Nancy Ferguson With big old wheels and a mighty grin Will always be right there to lend a hand And if you see him passing by the road Tip your hat and say hello To the greatest little tractor in the land On a winter's night, Murray and Massey were heading home after a hard day pulling out tree stumps. They weren't ready for what happened next. First of all, the road ahead became very bright. Oh, I can't see where I'm going. I'd better pull over. Out of the way, farm boy. Logs rolling through. Watch where you're going. Massey, you still look shocked. Yes, what a frightening thing to have happen. I hope he didn't scratch your paintwork as he went past, Massey. Typical of those big trucks. No manners at all. You've learned a valuable lesson tonight, though, Massey. There's always someone on the road bigger than you. The next morning... It looks like the storm is gone. Let's go and check the farm. Some trees might have blown over. Come on, Nessie. I'll race you to the end of the forestry road. OK, but no speeding, Gracie. The road doesn't look too safe after all that rain. What was that? Same sound I heard last night when that truck came past us. Let's go and look. It's the same truck. Well, if it isn't the little farm boy from last night, that big storm washed the road out of here. My name's Mac, by the way. They call me Big Mac. What you did to us last night was dangerous. Somebody could have been hurt. That's right. You tell him, Messy. Listen, why don't you run along and fetch a grown-up tractor? I need help here. I have to deliver these logs today, or my owners will lose a lot of money. Bad luck. I'm the biggest tractor you've got. But I have to get going. If I can roll that big log there into the ditch, you should be able to use it like a bridge and drive your wheels across it. Good thinking, Messy. That's using your spark plugs. But I don't want you speeding on those roads again. You shift that log all on your own. <sighs> OK, farm boy. If you can shift that log like you say, I promise I won't speed. But you're too small to do it. Massey had never tried to shift such a big load on his own before. I told you. You're too small. No, I'm not. No, he's not. Go, Missy. Ah. Yes, you've done it. Ooh, boy. I wouldn't have believed it. Hey, I'm sorry for running you off the road. Tell me, my friend, what's your name? His name's Massey from Ferguson Farm. He's got the tractor factor. I won't forget that name. Thanks to you, I'll be able to deliver my logs on time. I'll see you again. Don't forget your promise. I won't. No speeding. OK, goodbye. Logs rolling through. I'm so proud of you, Messy. You showed him what even a little tractor can do. Let's go and tell the others. Hang on, Gracie. Not yet. We haven't finished that race. You said no speeding. I won't have to speed. I got a head start. <laughs> Last one home is a garden gnome. <laughs> <laughs>